Well, hello there. Um, well, you can see who I'm doing now. I'm trying to make that a secret, but you know, whatever. Okay, okay, I think I got the camera better. And if you're, and I watched it over again, and I did talk nice, good, and loud, so I'm gonna continue on. Just even better, because I'm louder. Oh, I'm, I'm raising myself. That's pretty neat. Let's go, buddy. Now, I like using this character, well, especially in Rayman Oregon, mostly. But, you know, I really like this character ever since I started playing Rayman Oregon. I played that some way more. I used to think he was like some weird fat guy that they just, just in, that they just put into um, Rayman when I start when I like first started playing Rayman Arena was like the first Rayman game I ever played. But the first game I ever played was, eh, I'm not gonna talk about that. That's nothing to do with Rayman though. Oh come on, I'm so gonna lose. I'm just making that positive so everybody knows. I don't know why I'm doing so bad also. I don't know if it's just me not like the character at the moment or what. No, I'm forgetting. Swing Vine Time. Oh my gosh, he's such in front of me. What is the matter with me today? Okay, you know what? That's just just playing my best abilities. Oh my gosh, what is the matter with me? God, yo, get back here, bucko. Now it sounded like a little bit weird last time. It was like my voice was like really high or something. I don't know what it was. Uh, I think that was because I was trying to talk too loud when my uh, audio was fine. It turned out to be fine, fixed it already. So I was trying to talk too loud and make me sound weird. It sounded like a weird person that didn't sound like me. So I'm gonna stop trying to talk so loud and so good. Yeah, yeah. Oh, why did I do that? Oh my God, what's the matter with me today? Is he waiting for me? Was that like a glitch or something, or what? Or is that just how the game works if I'm way too far? Cause that's offensive, you know. Oh, thanks for the help. Okay, he shot. He shot one extra for me. I'm catching up to you, buddy. I don't think you can run away from me I'm right on your tail. Or your froggy tail. Froggy, what are you? That's a horrible, that's a, not horrible, I'd say it's a good impression of Big Cat. One of the most hated characters of all Sonic history. God, why did they make that character? God, why did they have to put him in the story of Sonic Adventure 1? And then, and then you have to beat him, that way you can get the final story. So you had to go through that story. I mean, my god, why? Why couldn't it just be Sonic? I, I, I even, I re, even rather play as, I'd rather play as any character. I mean, at the same time, yeah, I'd just rather play as any character. But there's something I have to comment on the Adventure series. Number one, they are the most awesome series of all Sonic. Sonic Adventure 2 Battle is my favorite Sonic game of all time. That's just number one. Right? That's how awesome it is. The story was awesome. The gameplay was just amazing. And it was just perfect. It was ultimate. And then don't even get me started on the Child Guy. I never stop playing the Child Guy. That's like my favorite thing of all Sonic. game and all that type of stuff and then I made the final blow with my best friend. God, it was amazing. It took us a long time to beat it though. Don't get me wrong on that. But it was good. It was a great game. But so is this. So let's keep it going. We only have two more cups left after this cup, believe it or not. Yeah, I was just shocked when I was looking at the map selection. I'm like, what? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Ugh. Do, 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 do. Awesome, great music here too. I mean, I don't like, I like Crush Forty the most. You know, side music. But, you know, I can, I can still, I can still enjoy this too. It's pretty catchy all the time. Ha ha! I messed you up. It was awesome. 
about this and other games that they don't do with that they do with other games is that you can like float forever. They're not gonna stop you like they're not gonna stop you from floating like in like with tail. They'll stop you from flying. Like in a certain Sonic game, I can't remember. They'll stop you from floating or a certain game I can't remember. Um, I think it was like um. I don't know, I can't remember, but still, it was like a game that I don't even remember if it was not a game or not. But you would just float, and then you'd only float for a limited time. What the heck? You just remind me of Tails being played. Seriously? And that's not only, like, one game of Tails being played, that's always Tails game. Like, anytime you ever get the chance to fly, because I know, like, inside Adventure 2 Battle, you can, you go and do mech, go and play the mech. At the same time, you can't play as tail outside of the mech when you do a shot guard, and you can fly forever. You can, you can never get tired as long as you hold on to the A button. Even if you like let go and press it again, like right after, and then hold on it, you're gonna you're gonna slow down. But you will stay in the air forever, and that's not just from my experience. That's literally that's literally whole card facts. Everybody knows that. All the reviews that people do who are like masters on Sonic that know more than I do will will say the same exact thing. And even if you like were, would look up can you can Tails fly forever in the Char Garden of Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, they will say yes. As long as you hold the A button, blah blah blah, you know all that stuff. It is literally just a straight down fact. That's one of the good things about Tails is that you actually got to you to do that only one time. I don't think you ever do that again in any Sonic games. A certain Sonic generation where you get to do like classic Tales and classic Sonic mission, where you were like kind of like holding as Tales, you could really fly forever, but you know, you really, that really wasn't how the stage was set up, but you could. You can never just stop flying. Else you die. So enough rambling about Sonic, because we're playing that Rayman game after all, but let's talk about Rayman a little bit. Nothing to say except for awesome, amazing, great, spectacular, and just so hardcore awesome. Do, 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 now. Man, are you ready to play this, like, as a kid? Well, I, I still am a kid, but you know, like, I mean, like, playing this when I was, like, six. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. You could. Uh, I was playing as Rayman one time, like last time I was recording, and I jumped on him. It was just like Mario was just that when you jump on it, you don't, he doesn't die. You just like jump on him and you'll just bounce off. It's pretty neat. Thought that was like really cool. Oh yeah, I forgot about this part. Pretty cool. And I love this stage so much. It's just such an amazing stage because you have like so much room to run around. Kind, of, kind of, kind of. So. I think it's really easy. So we got this unlimited every single time. We go through this. Oh, we got enough time to be able to, you know, not be rushing this time. We're doing pretty good. Oh, you know, I just love the stage. You're like mostly on water and then it's just great graphics and everything. Not just, not just this stage, but you know, it's everything. It's pretty awesome. I forgot who I'm racing. I think it's still, I think it's still the fall guy. Yeah, it's still the fall guy. Okay. Sorry I'm taking all the shortcuts. I just love them the most of the year. So much fun. But I might as well show off a little bit less than only shortcuts. Ah, ooh, ee, 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 ee. Ooh. Wee, ow. Oh, yeah. Ow. Ow. Oh, yeah. Haha. <laughs> Bam, 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 bam. Let's get it. Oh. Let's get this. Jump. Float. Oh, come on. Whatever. I'll show off this part. 
And then, you know what? Why not? Wait, no, I have to get, I have to get out there. That way I can show off that part. Skidoosh! Oh yeah, this little part right here. I love this part. Like the ultimate shortcut. And then you can stay here. On a lap. A little shortcut. Quick shortcut to get to the shortcut you were at. Faster. So yeah, I just love this stage. They only get longer or shorter. Depends. Now, what I've been noticing is that, like, each cup go- Okay, there's a certain order the characters go in, it's like, first character, like, that your circle will be on. I'll, I'll have to show it off in the next video. First character, or maybe you have extra, some extra time to show it off. Um, show it off. The first character that the circle is on when you, like, click into one player racing will be Rayman, and then the, and then you flick it to the right will be the frog guy, and then right again it will be the- pirate guy and what I just noticed spoiler alert if you don't want to hear this hold your ears hold your ears if you don't want to hear this but the next cup is the pirate cup oh pirate cup you can unhold your ears now and you know and that kind of matches with the pirate guy and it also matches in this world cup matches with the frog guy so I'm, no, I'm wondering if the first four characters match with the first four cups. It's a little thing to think about. I don't know. You know? But either way, I have to show that off. The first four characters. That you already have unlocked. You just automatically get unlocked. We're gonna go see. Okay, I have a new race. Optical course. Now this is what I mean. The first circle is on Rayman, and then the second circle is on him. And, oh, okay. I'm a little bit off because the first characters are not all of this. Okay, never mind. I take back everything I said. But next time we're gonna be playing as Tennessee's. Last time was Glow Box and Rayman, of course. So Tennessee's for the third. Oh. Goodbye, mates.